I'm Siobhan and this is Gypsy. Today I'm going to be showing you how to do braids in your horse's mouth. I'm going to be demonstrating three types of braids on Gypsy. This is Gypsy here and I've already brushed out her mane. It's always, it's always good to use things like detangler. I use this um, mane and tail detangler. It's the best. It can spray and then if your horse doesn't like spray bottles, another good type is Cowboy Magic. Then you need to take your hair, your horse's mane, you, but you have to first make sure that it's all nicely brushed out. Hers I've already brushed out. Then you can take and you can either do the simple braid, which you do like, um, you do small parts, about that big. I'm going to start over here so I can show you. I'm going to demonstrate a few different types of braids. You're going to take it and you're just going to do a normal braid like that. Just going to do a normal braid, but you don't want to do sections too big, because if they're too big, that's what they should look like. I don't know if you can see that from there. I'm going to get some. Then you're going to want to take your hair ties. I just put mine in my pocket while I'm busy, and then you're going to tie. You, you can make them a short braid, or you can make it until you run out of hair like that then you can also do this type which I call twists you take it Gypsy sorry you take this and you you take like about a, about the, a little more than what you did with the normal braid you're going to take and you're going to put it into just a normal ponytail like this there we go in a normal ponytail like this, and you're going to take it, you're going to split it in half, and you're going to twist it, you're going to put that through the top, and bring it through the bottom like that. Then you can braid the end, or you can just leave it like that. Then there's the running braid, which I'm going to do over here, at the top here, and it's going to run down. You're just going to, every time you take the one from the side where your horse's mane is lying, so for me it's my left, you're going to add a little bit of mane. You're going to do it all the way down, you can do this for your horse's whole mane in one breath. I do this a lot at uh, rodeos because it's simple and it's very pretty. It's simple to do and it doesn't take a lot of time too. So, at rodeos you want to get your horse done as fast as possible so you can get in the ring and start warming them up. If you do this, as I call it, the running braid, it's quick, it's very, it's beautiful, it's one of my favorite braids, and it keeps their hair out of their way. And in the summertime I do it for her because she gets sweaty under her mane because her mane is so thick. It's a very simple braid. And it's a lot of fun. It's one of my favorites, as I said. And yeah, it's very simple. You can do it all the way down her mane, but for the purpose of this video, I'm just going to do it in a small section because I want to show you all the three braids next to each other. Now, this is what they should look like. This is the running braid. As you can see, this is just a plain, straight, normal braid. And then this is a twist. Over here it's like, and those are the three different types. They're very easy to do, a lot of fun. Gypsy especially likes this riding braid. It works very well with her. And these twist braids you can also do at the end. You can continue braiding it like a normal braid. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I want to thank you for watching my video. And I want to thank my horse for being so good during this video. And uh, I want to ask you to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel.